Section 11 of the Anzac Book. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. The Yarns That Abdul Tells by A.P.M. From the Anzac Book, edited by C.E.W. Bean, read for LibriVox.org. One of the chief pastimes of the Turks who live behind the black and white sandbags opposite, writes an officer who knows them intimately, is that of listening to stories told by the storytellers in the cafes of the Asia Minor villages. The hero of these stories is very often a certain Nastradi Hadja, who really existed at one time and made a reputation by his wit as well as through his stupidity. Here is an example of the sort of story about Nastradi which especially pleases the Turk. Nastradi Hodja's wife woke up one night through hearing a noise. She got up and, going out onto the landing on the upper floor outside her bedroom, called out, Nastradi, what was that noise? Nastradi's voice came up from below. Don't pay any attention to it, he said. It was only my shirt that tumbled down the stairs. Does a shirt make such a noise? she asked. No, was the reply, but I was in it. A.P.M. End of section 11.